Hello and welcome. This week, we here at Board Crazy have returned to the temple for another martial arts showdown, and this time we have some new moves up our sleeve with Onitama, Sensei's Path. So, uh, normally at the beginning of our videos, I do a little introduction where I explain sort of how the game is played. Since we already played Onitama on the channel about a month ago, we're going to insert that section from that video explaining the rules uh, right here. If you've already seen that and want to skip ahead, we will have a, a timestamp listed and you can go to that time and just get right to the gameplay. Onitama is a game for two players designed by Shunpei Sato and published by Arcane Wonders. It is an abstract game where players try to outmaneuver their opponents using various martial arts techniques. At the start of the game, both players are dealt two movement cards apiece, and a fifth card is set to the side. Each card represents a different school of martial arts and offers the players various unique movement options. The first player chooses one of their movement cards and moves one of their pawns to a space as allowed by that maneuver. They then take the card that had been set aside and add that to their hand and replace it with the card they had just used. Then the second player does the same thing and play repeats like that until one player is victorious. There are two ways to win in Onitama. There is the Way of the Stone, which is accomplished by simply capturing your opponent's master pawn. Uh, any pawn can be captured by simply using a movement to enter its space. Uh, the other way to win is the Way of the Stream, which is accomplished by moving your Master Pawn into the Temple Arch space on the other side of the board. The game is really as simple as that. Let's not waste more time. Let's get started. So, welcome back to Board Crazy. Uh, I am D, joined once again by these two. Oh, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm Will. That's Will. And? I am Sensei Graham. Okay. Guys, I hate where I'm sitting. You may have noticed that the people to my left are sitting in opposite seats. Same people, usual. different yeah. seats. Yeah, uh, we'll get to why in a moment. Uh, so, Sensei's Path is a uh, s collection of 16 new uh, movement cards uh, for the game, uh, which we will be using exclusively. You, you can mix these up with the original cards, of course, but we're going to try out some new ones here. Uh, Graham is the reigning champion. Uh, he will be playing as the uh, red team in this, in this in this video, so he's gonna be sitting over there uh, to sort of make things easy for him. Will as the uh, un I'm red number two. You're the unbiased arbiter. Can... If no, if if Grant, <laughs> I'm unbiased. <laughs> you put, if you have kind of red and blue, if you have to, yeah, yeah a little bit of both. If okay. something happens, oh, I can. That's I I true. There is a little bit of blue. I could yeah. tap you in. Yeah. I, okay. Give you a little tap. Handicap match. Yeah. Tap tap. So yeah. well, Baru and D, you're blue. I am blue. -ish. So you're playing as a blue. I am blue. I'm also seen on this side. So it's gonna be. I'm doing a little change up here. Mm -hmm. okay. My sensei will be played by an hourglass. If you don't a capture mini, mini, mini mini hourglass, hourglass by the end of the hourglass, uh -huh. uh, oh, you lose. Ooh, it's a fun house rule. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, Will. Uh, if you would like to deal out our cards that we'll be using in this game of uh, all right, so let me yeah, give him a little shuffle. Thank you a little shuffle. Oh. Right. <laughs> the worst shuffle ever. He's so good at shuffling. Um, See, this is why I sit there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a shuffler spot. Graham always does this, and I feel like when have I done that? Never does that. When have I done that? Well, you work at casinos and you um, World Series of Poker. Yeah, so you don't. You also did that celebrity game it's on a card right NBC. There. Sp yeah, he forgets those. He always does that. Uh -huh. Now they're a mess. So how do I? How do you want me to? Shuffle these, put these out. Just, just do what you All right, so do. Say, we'll say D's cards first. Okay. D, mm -hmm. the rat. What are you trying to say? Because he's a rat. Graham, here's your first card. The iguana. Because Ooh. I'm an iguana. Yeah. <laughs> these are complicated. This might be quick if someone's not paying attention. D, your second card uh -huh. is... Oh, my the God. Tuna. Tuferki? Tanuki. Tanuki. It's like a raccoon. It's like a tuna turkey. It's weird. It's the opposite of the iguana. Oh, oh interesting. The inverse. I mean, we always get those. That's what Tanuki is. I'm gonna draw from the middle here. Okay. It's unorthodox. The Viper, Randy Ooh. Orton. No, mm, all right. Which is like almost the inverse, and that's actually not. No, it's the a mouse different. is the inverse mm. of this one. And then I'm gonna let get three blue ones out. Okay, there. Why don't you, why don't you pick the fifth? The it's new better card. be a red or a green. It's, it's the card that I don't pick. Come on, mm. Kieran. Oh, you know, okay. <laughs> the dog. Ooh. Which ah. is what color? Blue. We got a lot of blue. Whole lot of blue. The blue Lots of blue. We need a whole lot of blue. The, These are red and his two are red. No, I mean the moves are 
Oh, left yes. Left going. Yes, yeah, left going movement. Okay, so... Uh, D goes first. D goes first, because this oh, yes. icon is blue. <laughs> this game's all luck. <laughs> We're gonna, let's get into that. Yeah, we can uh, maybe. Uh, no, he looks down on you. <laughs> Japan's known for earthquakes and stuff, right? Or oh it, wait, or is it? Not, but this not is super stable. Is it not for earthquake? Tsunamis. Super stable. Tsunamis. Maybe? The tsunami's gonna come. Oh, have some earthquakes. Super stable. I'm gonna go uh, forward one with uh, I think uh, this fellow with my rat. The rat. Okay, <sighs> so you take the dog. The rat goes up there. Mm-hmm. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. Oh wait, mine are actually really <laughs> similar. The only difference between these two is this spot right here. Mm, yeah. <laughs> um. So in that, because of that, I will just move this guy forward with the viper. Nice. Um. So you guys, uh, which which is your? If all of these animals here, mm -hmm. if push came to shove, which one would you? Um, like throw on a spit and barbecue and eat. Um, the viper, the vi not D. No hesitation, not the rat. I would do the no. tanuki. What's you, a tanuki? Because it's, I don't know what like it a is. Raccoon. I'm gonna put a tanuki up. It's, on like, it's, like, a, it's like a raccoon dog. A raccoon dog. Yeah. I, ooh. Raccoon dog. Hmm. Yeah, give me that raccoon dog. <laughs> you want to eat the raccoon? I. I mean, I'm with Graham. Uh, Just I think interesting. I, I think I need the tanuki. There doesn't it sound Ooh. like a bird that you would eat? People eat snakes. That's I've people also eat I've dogs. Seen, I've seen so. bear grills do it. Yeah, but yeah. dogs are cuter. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't mm -hmm. eat a dog. I could do an iguana. That's the only, there's only two I would eat here. So if you were on, let's say, naked I mean, and afraid, yeah. right? I, I mean, preferably it'd be a panda. Okay, but let's say you're on the hit Discovery Television show, <laughs> Naked and Afraid. Uh huh. What would be? Brain Japan. What would be the hardest thing? For, no. Uh, Sure, let's say that you're in Japan Actually. for some reason. What'd you do? I move forward with the rat. This guy forward with the rat. You would. You rat. You rat bastard. Actually, no, I'm going to say you're in a rainforest. What would be the animal you'd be most hesitant to eat? In, that in a rainforest? Jaguar. Yeah, because you know, we've seen that show enough. You know what they usually eat. What would um, be the one that's like, you just couldn't be... do it? Well, I just think I wouldn't eat a snake because I'd get, be too afraid of getting bitten while attacking it. I get your, so you would kill, you wouldn't want to kill the snake. That's your problem. Yeah, because I, I would get afraid, I would be afraid of, you know, yeah. the snake biting me. I've heard snake, I've never had snake, but I've heard that like rattlesnake at least tastes good. A monkey or like uh, whatever uh, would be hard to eat too just because they're so, I guess, human-like? Is that the... <laughs> that was going to be my answer. Yeah, I don't think I could eat a monkey or like an ape of any sort. It's too... Yeah, it is too much like cannibalism. Yeah. Um, so it's always tough to look at his and think about from his mm -hmm. direction what they look like. Hmm. Last time I played and I lost. Graham's the grand champion of Onatama. He is the... Uh, not monk, the sage champion? Say grandmaster. Grandmaster champion. Grandmaster. Grandmaster yes. Flash. Grandmaster. Mm -hmm. Grandmaster. What you doing, Graham? Um, hmm. Indeed. Hmm. D, if you were to be on Iron Chef. That, oh, yeah. Again. Which one of these animals would you want to be the secret basket ingredient? Not basket, um, under the, the secret ingredient you gotta use. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I don't think my answer would be any different. You're still talking about consuming one of these. But they're live, so you have to butcher them. Oh, iguana. The, iguana? Yeah. Okay. Mark Dacascus would be let down by that. Well, I don't know why. Well, he chooses the ingredients. Uh-huh. See, Mark Dacascus is a Michelin star, James Beard award-winning mm. actor. I don't know what any of this means. You wouldn't, because you don't watch cooking shows. <laughs> All right, my move. I like what Graham's doing. I'm going to use my uh, full back back video. He's using it, too. To Ferky. Tofurky. <laughs> Tofurky is one of the animals on here. <laughs> it's actually a real thing. What's he gonna do? He's thinking really hard. It's making me a little bit nervous. Um, yeah. Because whenever he thinks, it's scary. I can feel it. His thoughts are viscous. That's a word I, I try to describe mm. his thoughts. Ooh, see, like that. Like, he did something mm -hmm. there and he's thinking. What did he actually he, move? He's got moves. Pick a card, Will. Whatever this card is. Is something you have to eat. Apparently, that's how this game works. <laughs> All right, so I have to eat the card. No, not the card. You have to eat the animal. You have to find the animal in, in in the world wilderness, kill it, and eat it. I'm letting my next week. We'll come back with our uh, <laughs> progress report. Will's journeys mm, to Japan. Right. This one feels right. Uh huh. I shall be eating 
A sable. What what is that? What's a sable? Mm. It's uh, Brock Lesnar's wife. Mm. <laughs> it's Brock Lesnar's wife. Uh, D, come on. It's the second wrestling. A sable? Aw. It's, it's like a Martin. What's a Martin? Martin Lawrence? It's like a little like weasel kind of thing. Mm. I don't want to kill that. It's we, cute as hell. Well, you can, folks at home can look it up. Um, I guess I'm going to be cooking a sable next week on the show. Yep. Uh, Will loves to eat precious animals. <laughs> little cute animals. I, I, I try to draw again. I get chinchilla. <laughs> I draw again. I get puppy. Hey, where is this guy? Was right here. Mm-hmm. What would the way of the puppy quote be? Oh, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> you doing Graham? I don't know. Ooh. I really don't know. Cowards move. Who's I have no first, strategy right now. Move their um, um, emperor guy. Their emperor guy. Because remember, I, I when I played, I didn't move my emperor guy, and until it was too late, and Graham surrounded me. Hmm. 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 Huh. Hmm. I mean, ultimately, it really doesn't matter. Hmm. All right, D. Like I said, I gotta see stuff I got, and I can't. Okay. <laughs> if D can move, I don't know. If D can move his boss guy up here, it would leave you a corridor to just walk right in. Ooh, maybe he should do that. Yeah, maybe he should. I gotta say, uh, the Anatama mat, while cool, smells like tires to me. Maybe it's made of tires. It's made of tires. Michelin. <laughs> is there what? It's what interesting are, that Michelin is Goodyear does, another brand of tires. It's interesting that Michelin Goodyear. makes tires, but they also rate restaurants. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the same company. Yeah, I'm yeah. not even messing around. That's how Japan works. Japan? Yeah. Are they Japanese? Michelin's French. Wait, that, that's are the they? same company. Oh, what am I thinking? Yeah, it's of? like Michelin or whatever. What am I thinking of? I actually had no idea that it was the same company. Japanese? Maybe. Bridgestone might be Japanese. Jap- yeah. Maybe or Bridgestone's probably American. No, I don't think so. I think it's Japanese. Yokohama is Japanese. Uh, let's not be racist. <laughs> no, Yokohama is uh, uh, from uh, it's Iowa City, Iowa. It's where they make Yokohama. Hmm. Uh, so hold on, no, so they're actually the same thing. What? There's no way the Michelin tires and no, yeah, okay, so they are the same thing because Michelin, the tire, the like the tire company used to make like a, a travel guide, okay. and they started off by one of the things they would do is go to restaurants and give them like ratings. Okay. And then those ratings became like legit, and then it just became like a thing they do. So now they do tires, and they're like the top, hmm. like restaurant critics. It's weird. Interesting. Bridgestone. Mm. Bridgestone. <laughs> ironically, not ironically. Bridgestone is a Japanese company founded by Shojiro Ishibashi in the city of Kurume, Fukuoka, 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 Japan. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm a genius. Graham, you're up. Yeah, I know. Yeah, there's no, there's no like one space to the right. I know. Option, which is rough. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I could have drawn more red, but I didn't. <laughs> but I didn't. We're all, we're, we're like, we're like twisting this way. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's how the cards are. Mm-hmm. Uh. I'm, I'm saving this one. <laughs> yeah, you're the saving one that one red. red-handed move. Graham just has to keep going yeah. left or forward, or backward into the. To the right, it looks like. What you gonna do, Graham? Oh, I think maybe I will. The coward's move. Go forward. That makes sense to me. Yeah, if I were you, I'd press him. Look at this. What's this guy doing? I, Why is I, he staring I, at you? You're gonna see your guy. I mean, <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. He's just kind of there. I can't move him this way. <laughs> oh, I get it. Yeah, that guy's gonna be like for the whole game until D moves the. Ooh. Graham, ah, trying to bait you. Darn bait, it. A bait and, what's it called? A bait. It's baiting you. I'm baiting you towards my master. I think we made this joke last time. Doing it anyway. We got our new posters, guy. Oh, yeah, I didn't even mention that. You might have noticed uh, we have uh, some fancy new posters on the wall behind me here. Uh, thanks to um, BoardGameGeek.com for their little... Good, good website. Poster really good website. ...thing. I don't know what it was called. It was a contest. You're a contest. I'm not a contest. It wasn't it? Well, no, they didn't have a contest. They just held a series of. They wanted to start doing posters. So yeah. this is two from series one. That's uh. Serial. That's uh. What's this one? The game. Checkers. Yeah. It's real tough to, to tell. Huh? This is. Is it Agricola or Agricola? I say Agricola. I don't care what anyone says. Graham, you're still up, by the way. In case you've forgotten. I always. Like, I haven't forgotten. I always like Dia Agricola. 
<laughs> Come on. Cherry agriculture. Oh, great. Oh, oh, I missed it. You missed it. Hmm. Man, this is uh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna do that. I yeah, don't know why, but I'm doing it. Okay. He's got those moves. Don't like Jagger? No. I didn't say it. He did. So based on this setup, Will, mm -hmm. what is your favorite color? <laughs> okay. <laughs> based on this setup. This setup. Can't believe I'm saying this. But brown. Brown. Yeah. Did you know if you mix red and blue, you get brown? I did know that, yeah. Actually, isn't brown, in truth, created by mixing all the colors together? I have no idea. Yeah, that's the way you do it. Your shirt kind of looks brown, it's red and blue. It is. So where do they do that? Yeah, it is. It's like they made a red shirt and then put some blue into it. Or was it the other way around? Now you're making me think. It's kind of <laughs> like our... Mind blown. Are zebras white with black stripes, or are they black with white stripes? Whoa. I never even thought of that. <laughs> Seriously. Have, has anyone proved one way or the other? They gotta be white with black no stripes, idea. right? No one's taking the bait yet. Someone will soon. What's Graham gonna do? Gonna do? Oh, look at all these nice right hand movement cards. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like. Uh, what is this? That's like neutral. Killing. Yeah, move. we didn't get any of the neutrals. It's all left handed movement. Mm -hmm. What you doing, Graham? And I can't. Move my guy forward here because of this guy right there, which is frustrating. You can move him right. I could, but I'll move doing? Are you Tanuki waiting? Are you Tanuki stalking? This way. And. Smart. This. Tanuki stalking. Are either of these guys going to ever actually move? <laughs> Probably not, right? It's basically been like someone uses something, someone uses rat, someone uses something, someone uses rat. Oh, now. Now, I got to move. There's nothing there. I don't, I don't, you can't move no. to the right. Right? No. No. Oh wait, yeah. Okay, so iguana for viper. God. I know this is. I mean, I like the challenge that this many left-hand movement cards presents, mm. but I do feel like it creates a really hard situation for the mind to be able to see what to do next. Especially since Steve's not sharing the wealth of the right-handed movement. Ooh, Graham. What did he just... He used his rat. He used his rat. The rat just bit through your man. Is there Onitama fan fiction? You know, I haven't checked, weirdly enough. <laughs> you haven't checked, weirdly enough? You yeah. should. Yeah. We should. And if there isn't, we should start a movement. Uh -huh. Onitama fan fiction. Movement. Graham. Casual reminder that I can just take your master if you don't move him. No, I, I know. Just Point it out. I don't know what's going on in your head. It's crazy in there. If I don't, or I could capture you. You could, if you want to move forward. But wouldn't that put you in a bad situation? Or I could capture him by doing this. Also, oh, snap. Oh, snap. Oh, I snap. actually have no idea if that's the right move, but I did it. Wait, where were you? Here. Yeah. You could move back, back into to the, the right. right. Yeah, you did that right, properly, I mean. In your face! Red Boom! Rain. Red Ranger. Bias. Uh, who is the Red Ranger? What was his name? Rocky? Nope, that's three Jason. ninjas. Three ninjas. Jason. There's Rocky, Colt, and Tom Tom. Are you always, are you more of a Colt or more of a Tom Tom? Um. Because you clearly weren't a Rocky. Colt 45. Colt 45, yeah. Colt. Did you, are you a three ninjas expert? I don't think that was a quote. People, I, I, we're old. So a lot of you probably don't know what three ninjas is. But if you're, a normal human being, you should go back and watch Three Ninjas. It's a pretty classic film. Just the first and the third one, though. What's wrong with the third one? No, just the first and the third one. Oh, what was the second one? The second one has different kids. Does it? No, I thought Colt stays the same throughout the series. Possibly, but the other ones are different. Points remains the same. Fine, the third one must be the one where they're trying to get back to their baseball game. Third then. one has the same kids as the first one. People are really entertained by this who know about Three it's Ninjas. True. Everyone else is checking out. It's a hot topic. Yeah. What's his name? Sinbad? Nope. No. Nope. Sinbad's not in that. Um, no, the... Uh, John Hurd? No, the Asian guy. Gets eaten in Tremors. 
Right. I don't know his actor's name. It's like something Wong? Hong? You, you, you of all people should know this, Will. I don't think Go ahead, do your turn. Is he like, it's not like James, James Hong or something? No, that's a Chinese name. Wouldn't he be Japanese? They're Why ninjas. He's Japanese, Will. It's not, they don't care that much. Okay, so the character's name is Mori Tanaka. The actor is Victor Wong. Victor Wong, okay. <laughs> I knew it. I said Wong. It was in there. <laughs> That's amazing. Look, Will, anyone can be Japanese if they try hard enough. Yeah. I have, honestly have no idea what you guys are... What is this? Three Ninjas. Oh, Three Ninjas. The kids, they're kids' movies. So, Colt is 37 years old. How old's Rocky? Wait till he's 45. 38. Interesting. All right, I'm just going to out, point out that uh, the actor who played Tom Tom, his name is Chad Power. Good name. He thinks Chad Power is a good Chad name. Chad Power. Chad Power is not a good name. He tanuki you. He took it. Wow. I wasn't right. thinking he'd actually use it. Well, yet. no matter what, you're going to get the tanuki now. I know. Unless you quit. <laughs> Forfeit. He quits. <laughs> I quit. You can move, Graham? I dare you to move. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh crap. Okay, he can't get into your shrine. Not yet. This guy has to get into the shrine. Oh, it wasn't just. It isn't just some random guy sitting. No, there. no. Is it a shrine or is it like a hammock? Shrine. Okay. Silver monkey. A shrine. Was, uh, it's red shrine, but it's of the silver monkey. Do you guys remember how impossible the final round of Legends of the Hidden Temple was? It was impossible. Like, it was asking difficult. someone to sh put, put together... Difficult. What was the statue of? Was it a monkey? Silver monkey. Yeah. <laughs> That's how, name. How are you going to put that thing together in time? I don't know. And then you have those guys that come out and kill you. I hadn't given it much thought. What's Graham going to do? Well, while he's thinking, D, of all the 90s Nickelodeon game shows, yeah. which one would you want to be on the most? Be on the most? Yes. Now? Or, or then? then. <laughs> sure. Different question. Let's say that you were inhabiting the body of a 13-year-old, and you're going to be on a show. Nice. No, uh, not nice. <laughs> it's the wrong answer to that. All right. Um, uh, okay. Uh, if I'm going to be on one of those shows? Hmm. Um, Would it be Legends of the Hidden Temple? Would it be Nick Arcade? Would it be Figure It Out? I don't want to, I mean, Nick Arcade, I'm be interested in just to see how it worked. But, uh, I mean, it would probably, I mean, Wild and Crazy Kids was my number one when I was of age. Uh, but, I mean, you know, today, who knows? Might be more of a Guts guy. I think the only thing I can do. Oh, Guts was, Guts is a good one. I would hate it to be on Guts. Yeah. Not physical, God. not the build. I don't know. Flying all around, putting those bungee cords to stress <laughs> That's test. my only move. <laughs> That's certainly true. I would definitely wake, like, grade them. Ooh. That's my only move. I guess it is. Yeah. Graham, I think you're going to win. Why? Because he hasn't moved his uh, his big guy yet. Oh, wait, you used Tanuki? I had to. You had to. And you oh. have to... Oh. You get, once again, you have one move. Well, no, you've got two. you got two moves. I spoke too soon. I apologize. He can Tanuki you there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> two Tanuki. <laughs> the fine two Tanuki. Move up into the right. <laughs> into the right. A few spaces. You got this, Graham? Red team for days. Yeah, you're good. He can't get you there. I just want to see what his next move is then. Wasn't one of the Jackson 5 named Tanuki? Yeah, no, I, don't think I, can, I don't think I can get this. Tanuki Jackson. Tanuki Jackson. <laughs> Not unless you get the Tanuki back. No, I don't think it's bad. Yeah, I mean, the Tanuki, uh, that one's frustrating because it's the only one that moves right in the game and he's held it the entire time. Mm -hmm. Well, here's the thing. We know, we, because we're a red team, know, that he's not going for your shrine because he hasn't even moved this guy yet. He's going for you. I so, can't afford to move my guy because he's now, very close to it. Now he can tanuki you again. Yeah, I know. Mm. Crap. Mm. Rock around, we rock around to nuke. Nuke. You guys over here are just like, we believe in you. Yes, red team. I'm with them. We believe in you, coach. Don't research don't that. Envy you, you man. You just forfeit? What is that? How does that put me in a forfeit? Oh, shoot. I didn't even oh, think of that. Oh, no. I didn't even think of that. I didn't even have to tanuki you. He didn't even tanuki. Oh, well. The grand champ, the Graham champion. Oh. I am now Graham. Has been unseated. Oh, D, congratulations on your... S Mm. 
Why would I not shake his hand? He the held it out. Team don't support blue team. <laughs> So oh, that's, that's frustrating. frustrating. You yeah. don't even realize. Good game, though. No, that's so frustrating. Yes. I don't like those cards. I suppose it would be. Will, get my crown, please. This was a sample of what you can expect if you buy any time on Sunset's Sunset's Path. Sunset's Path. Uh, yeah. Uh, one thing, I really enjoy this game. This is definitely one I'll keep coming back to. Uh, I don't think we'll be reviewing this because it's just cards. They're more cards. They're pretty good. Yes. They, I think we can all agree. There's some neat ones in here. Will, they're not going to show them off. We didn't get a show off as Will, but you know, this one's kind of neat. Turtle! Turtle! Tyrant! Gira giraffe! Giraffe. So yeah, if you enjoy Onitama, there's no reason whatsoever not to get this, pretty much. Unless you're dead broke. It's like eight bucks, too, so. Unless you're dead broke. <laughs> or dead. Or dead. Yeah. If you're so. deceased and watching this, congratulations. Yes. Uh, yeah, but that is Onitama Sensei's Path. Uh, again, probably no review, but still, check out our website, BoardCraseGames.com, for all of our previous reviews of games we've played. Our original reviews of Onitama will probably be uh, linked to, I, I suppose, uh, in the description below. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and uh, please sign up for our website, BoardCrazy. Games.com. Games if you want to, you know, comment, interact with us, we'll be there. We'll see it. We see everything. Yeah. Everything. There's articles up there, news articles, um, some Kickstarter previews, list things. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, lots of stuff. So, thank you for watching, everybody. Yeah. Graham, it's okay. I know you don't like it. I'm frustrated about that. Yeah, it's a, it's a sour way to... Well, you know whose fault it is. I know, yeah. I know what it's like to lose in this game, it's and I hate it. I hate it. Especially, I don't like losing to him ever. So to lose to him and then lose in this game, well, that must really suck. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. Until next week, uh. toodaloo. Goodbye, everybody. Everybody. Sorry, Graham. That's all right. <laughs>